What's going on YouTubers? Um, just a quick tutorial. I'm going to be showing you how to make the music work in the game Die Hard for the PlayStation. Basically, the game Die Hard for the PlayStation, the music won't work if you download that game. But I'm going to show you how to make the music work. And how to make the music work in other games that the music doesn't work in. So basically, I'm going to run Die Hard now and show you. Um, Die Hard Trilogy. If I run it like this, the music will not work. So I'm going to show you an example. The reason for this is because it was a very early game for the PlayStation and um, it requires the CD for the sounds to work. This bit will work. Fox intro, that, that works, no problem. But I'm talking about the in-game music. I'm talking about the music that's in the actual game. You realise that it doesn't work. But I'll show you how to do that, obviously. wait for this bit to, to go off load in now so basically on the screen here, there should be music there should be music in the background you see and, and, and obviously there isn't any music so I'll just click on this mission uh, the Nakatomi building mission Wait for it to load. Obviously, that bit works as well. But in the actual game, there should be music here now in the game. See, there's no music whatsoever. Obviously, you can play it and kill people, but there's no music. Right, to make the music work guys, I'm going to show you now. So I'm just going to exit the game completely. Exit the game completely. Um, I have to do it this way because I spilt uh, wine on my laptop not long ago and some of my buttons don't work. Alright, to get the music to work in the game, click on your EPSX here. And in config, CD-ROM. I, I'm using Mubi 2, yeah? This is what I'm using. Right. Basically, use a CD ROM, Mubi 2 CD, disk image. Click configure. And where it says CDDA volume, make sure that's on 50. I don't know why, but I use 50, yeah? That's what I use to make the, to make the music work in the game. Right, use Mubi, go to 50. That's it, click OK. Click OK on that. And what you want to do now is run Die Hard on the CD-ROM. You've just configured the CD-ROM for Mubi. Now you've got to run that game in the CD-ROM. So click that. Die Hard Trilogy. And click OK. Because you're, you're using the CD. You're running it from the CD, you see. And, it, and, it, and it'll work with the sounds now. Which it didn't before running, the, running it through the ISO. So I should have the music now, guys. Maybe, maybe you've got some other games where the, the, the audio doesn't work. So I, I suggest do this to make it work. It took me a few days to figure this out until I read a message board. I thought I'd make a video on it just to show you people. So you don't have to go through all that trouble, you know. And obviously I'll have the music now on this bit as well. There you go. Music. Oh, it's it's working. Gonna get out of me. I don't like to lose. Don't stay alive. Stay with me. I'll click on the Nakatomi mission again. And you should hear the music now. Because I've run it from the CD instead of the ISO image file. There you go, guys. Turn up a little bit. The music's working now. That's how you do it.
Anyway, guys, that's the tutorial finished. Quick example of how to make it work. Hope you liked it. Thank you very much. Peace out.